Let's turn now to KCR3 weather. A lot of people watching it on this Labor Day weekend mm -hmm. as they make plans to head outdoors. And we're seeing some rain today. Yeah, we're seeing some rain uh, even in the valley. And this is going to be one of those scenarios until we get to later tomorrow when this low that's around kicks out. That's when we can really shut down most of the rain chances. But until then, expected to stay cool, somewhat unsettled, mostly for the foothills and the mountains. But even down here in the valley at times, there might be some raindrops. This is the big picture on Doppler radar. You can see the low that's just off the coast to our north and west and the moisture out ahead of it being drawn up from the south and it's moving right over eastern parts of the valley and into the foothills and the mountains this morning. So really from anywhere from Tracy where we're getting maybe some sprinkles right now through Highway 4 and Highway 12 up towards say Elk Grove and then all the way up to Fair Oaks and uh, Carmichael and even up towards uh, Lincoln all the way up towards the Grass Valley Nevada City area. We're getting these showers. Same thing along Highway 49 through uh, parts of Placer County and El Dorado counties and then look at this solid rain, especially up towards Quincy. It's coming down pretty good right now. So currently we have mostly cloudy skies here in Stockton to show you 65 degrees. We're cool in the valley in the 60s in the 40s right now at Lake Tahoe. I don't think the rain around Tahoe is going to be as steady and heavy as it was yesterday. We've got nearly an inch at the south shore of Lake Tahoe. Look at Capels Lake near Kirkwood along 88, about two and a half inches of rain in the past 24 hours. Much lighter amounts down in the valley and in the foothills. Look up towards Redding, though. They had quite the rain there. Redding uh, fire station reporting three inches of rain in just the past 24 hours. So let's look ahead with future cast. I think this is a little underdone. This is around noon today, noon 1230 might still have some showers on the east side of the valley in the foothills. Most of them will be over the Sierra and again, not quite as heavy as yesterday. The valley underneath the mixture of clouds and sun through a lot of the afternoon with the rain chances very, very slim. Now as we get into tonight, when this low finally gets a little bit closer, we might find some showers overnight. This is three o'clock in the morning making their way from south to north through the valley and look how heavy they seem to be on the west slope, especially from north of Highway 50 to 80 up towards Plumas County. We might even have some rumbles of thunder tomorrow morning, but by the midday and afternoon hours, more of the valley will see sunshine during Sunday afternoon and the showers and storms will be mainly over the higher elevations and then continue to push east. And then this is a look at Labor Day morning. We finally start to really clear things out and the afternoon looks nice and it looks brighter with just maybe a couple of isolated showers left in the high country. I think that's the much better day to try to get outside uh, in the mountains for today. Our high temperatures are going to stay cool because of that mixture of clouds and sun highs in the upper 70s to around 80 will be in the 60s and 70s in the foothills today. Tomorrow again, more sunshine for the afternoon and looking at the seven day forecast a high of 82 Labor Day looking much brighter mid to upper 80s and then the rest of the week looks like we'll enjoy a warm up, especially by Wednesday, Thursday and Friday with highs in the 90s by then, but certainly compared to last Labor Day, if you remember, this was the start of that really bad oh, heat yes. wave in Sacramento that got us to 116 the day I after remember. Labor Day. Yeah, it was crazy. What a difference. I think we'll take this over. Yeah, <laughs> I just heat. feel bad for the Tahoe folks that plan all year and save it for Labor Day to head up there. And then this year it's kind of a cool mix for sure. Mm -hmm. All right, they'll find something to do. Yeah, I'm sure. All right.